I'm AZ Russell, and this is Josie Coleman, and we are Career Service Specialists, which is a fancy way of saying we run Career Navigator and host all the employers that come to campus to recruit our students. One part of Career Navigator is that they upload a resume, um, and they're pretty horrible on first glance. So when we invite them to go to Career Network, to the Career Network Center, they work with them to make sure that all of those documents are, are clean and good, um, and then they can upload those in Career Navigator so that when they apply for a job, they can use that reviewed resume, you know, or those cover letters or professional documents or whatever they're having reviewed, um, and put it in Career Navigator so that when employers see it, they're impressed. Okay, a lot of people just give us the cold shoulder, like, oh, we don't need to worry about it right now. We don't. We have four years to figure it out. But honestly, it's like the that's the worst decision because the best time is to build your resume because you want to have the best optimal resume to get a job, and by doing so, you have to do internships and you have to do like different work, and you can do that through your first you know first few years in college, and that's like the best time because then you can get an amazing internship like at Google or you know um, Goldman Sachs or somewhere that's really like prime and wonderful and it's good on your resume and you can't really do that if you don't have any experience you know we can't really do that unless you know people your navigator and making sure your document's professional the alumni association making sure you know somebody and then the foys elder sister foy helping you get connected in that actual city um, students have a lot of opportunity to get really good internships and more jobs